Welcome back to Coin Sense and Nonsense. Today, it's a special shout out to Dean at Tomoko's Enterprise. Get well soon, Dean. Uh, we're uh, all missing you badly there and uh, wishing you'll be back soon here on the YouTube airwaves. So, uh, today, we're going to check out the new, well, relatively new, oh, it's a gold coin. Part of the Looney Tunes series. What? So, I've got all the original ones. You know, like they said, there was going to be five. So, I got all the five. And then, when Christmas rolled around, they had the Christmas ornament one with Lola. So, oh, hello! That's not Lola. Or Lolita. <laughs> Uh, oh, that's another story. But anyway, um, so yeah, so that was the that was the Christmas one, of course. So you know, you got to keep going with the series, even though they're not related. You figure, you got to go for it. And then New Year's comes along, and it's the year of the pig. So they do the Porky Pig. Wait, I just br almost broke it. Then they do the Porky Pig one for Year of the Pig, but this one's a one ounce. Um, so yeah, and then it's Valentine's Day, so they had to do the love struck coin, and so of course I'm buying all these, and there it is, and so there's Lola again, I'm not gonna do that joke again, but then they announced there was a gold coin, and they said it was part of the set, and so you can't just have the set. And not have the set, right? I can't just say, well, I have the silver Looney Tunes set. I have to, if it, they're calling it a nine coin set, you gotta have the nine. There's the other eight. So, shut up already. Let's open this darn thing and check it out. I'm gonna do the tripod. I haven't even seen it yet. I've had this for a little while. Shame on me for not opening it. But, um, let's check it out. Hope that's really in there. Oh, nicer case, that's for sure. Nicer than the regular. Oh, here's my COA. There's only 750 of these. What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? 89. That's cool. That's cool. There you go. So, yeah. You'll see it probably before me. Oh, it will slide. Oh, it's sideways. It's sideways. Look at that. What's up, Doc? Wow, that is cool, cool, cool. So this is a quarter ounce of gold. And it's, uh, I believe... It's four nines gold, but I will double check that, Mr. Monkey Swag. So yeah, this is awesome. Um, I will uh, pop it out of here and we will get it for a closer inspection. Well, I guess if I would have taken the time to read the COA, I would have seen that it's four nines gold right there. So that is cool. There's a better shot of the uh, COA in case uh, it was shaky earlier or too bright. So, yeah. Alright, here we are. Wow, this is cool. Go, go, go. Gold Bugs Bunny. So, yeah, this is. Uh, well, yeah, it's not even close to that one, so that is good that it's like a different, uh, I better, oh yeah, it has metal orientation, and hello, there she is in gold, I think I, uh, this is my first one of this portrait in gold, or this effigy, I do have some of the younger ones, but, um, yeah, this is awesome, I love it, so, Tuvalu, Tuvalu, $25, 
So, and yeah, there's the four nines gold, quarter ounce, and reeded edge. And yeah, the, I don't think they're individually numbered on the coin itself, but, um, so what do you say? Do we need to, no, I don't think this needs a microscope job there. That's just a proof. It is pretty awesome, but I think this is good enough here. Cool, cool, cool. Yeah, so, this is more of a collector piece than the value of the gold there. That's for sure. It's got a ways to go to catch up to <laughs> catch up to what I paid for it in uh, spot price. But uh, it was the collectability part of it to have it for the for the rest of the set. So I've got the whole thing. So. I guess that's the hazards of being a collector. You got to have them all. So, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, thanks so much for watching Coin Sense and Nonsense. And again, Dean, get well soon. Thanks so much for watching Coin Sense and Nonsense. And until next time, bye. Bye.